When I was a little girl, my mother used to tell me a story about a princess who lived on a beautiful island surrounded by turquoise waters, where the sky kissed the sea. When the princess met her prince, their love grew stronger than the waves crashing against the shore. So, when I met Jack one day on the beach, he was everything I had been searching for. I thought it was fate. But I had forgotten something very important. Every fairy tale has a monster. In my life story, the monster's name was Gansirankiri, a man whom I later found out was a ruthless crime lord. Little did I know, our paths were destined to collide. Now, a little birdie told me you're very bitter about land deals that happened between our families, where supposedly my family got land that belongs to you. You have to understand, that wasn't me. I should have squatted you a long time ago when I have a chance. Let's bury the hatchet. No. In Cambodia, there is not enough room for the boss of us. That means one of us has to die. We will leave it to fate. You were always a cheat. In matters of life and death, there is no cheating, just living and dying. Whose choice of weapons? High sword. Winner, take all. Well, that puts me at a disadvantage because you're a master of the knives and the swords. Maybe I'll survive. Maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe not. Practice, my old friend. I expected more from you. <laughs> Gentlemen, mysteriously, uh, our competitors are gone. You all have done a great job. I just want to say that violence is the last resort because it attracts a lot of attention. But when we have no choice, we're pretty good at it. Chayo. 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 Good job. Celebrate. Okay, Sam. Thanks around the corner, man. You ready? I know what time it is, Jack. Just trying to shoot me with that thing, okay, pal? 
Jesus Christ. Hold on. Can we go now? Let's go! Everybody freeze if you don't speak English! Down! Don't even think about it! Down! Okay, yes, man, stop there and cooperate with us and nobody gets hurt. You manage it. Manage nobody it. listen to yeah, yeah, Open it, open it, open it. You, 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 out, out, out. Keys. One Keys. minute! Come on, man. Go, 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 go! <laughs> You came down! Move! Out the shit and move! Okay, we're good. Get out of here! Minute 45, go! You tell him it's a two for last! Come on, man! Holy shit. What are they doing with all this US currency? I mean, this is like a crazy amount of money. How much money do you think that is? I ain't got a clue. I've been busy. Why would a small bank in Cambodia have this much cash, man? Stop complaining. We scored, mate. We scored. Man, I'm not complaining. What if they check the bags on the border? Trust me, they won't. It's a good thing. I brought this. Great. You expect us to take this amount of cash through our bodies? Tough guy like you scared of some tape? It's not the taping I'm worried about. It's taking it off, my son. Taking it off. You're a hairy bastard, man. It'll do you some good. Jesus Christ. You're always trying to call that chick. You need to get a life, mate. She is my life, man. You're so whipped. Is that why you're doing this? Maybe. What's it to you? It just makes me nervous working with such a pussy. Never, man. Let's get you taped up. No, 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 no. After you, mate. Turn around and bend over. <laughs> get up from me, fucker. This is serious. Just fucking tape me. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Thank you.
Hey, baby. Hey, you. Want to do me a favor and ditch that thing? I just started work. You just finished work. <laughs> Believe me. My mother died when I was young, but she taught me not to take shortcuts in life. When I got older, I didn't go for the quick cash in go-go bars like some other girls I knew. Jack and I were working towards our dream so that someday we can live on that beautiful island together. Can I open my eyes yet? Oh well, no, not yet. I'll tell you when it's okay. Okay, open up. It's the one that I saw from the store window last week. I love it. <laughs> really, I do. But honey, we can't afford this. That's the surprise part. Come here. Let me show you something. Come on, baby. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Oh my God, what is that? <laughs> that is why you don't have to work at the club anymore, Avalon. And it's all yours. I don't understand. Where did you get it? Don't ask me where, or how, or why. No, I'll tell you why. It's because I love you. I want you to stick around. I'm not going anywhere. I love you. Don't you know that? You have to tell me where you got all this money. Evelyn, honey, I'm serious. It's better that you just don't know. So, how do I explain where I got it? You can't explain this to anybody, okay? Now, honey, I'm not telling you what to do, but we can't spend this money right now, okay? Now, maybe we can have a little fun, but I'm gonna put most of it away somewhere safe. <laughs> You're crazy, you know that? I'm crazy for you. You know what we should do? What? We should go on holiday. Mm. To an island, like where we met. Anything you want, baby doll. <laughs> I'm gonna go clean up, okay? Okay. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. I think you've been naughty, Jack. Oh, yeah? It's a naughty time. Whoa, whoa, baby, that's not a toy. You didn't tell me you had a gun, Jack. It slipped my mind. Now, don't point that. Don't worry so much. The safety's on. Come here. Why don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Do me on all this cash. Hmm? Don't make me ask you twice, Jack. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> is that? This is called uh, Rosa Belle de Londres. It's known as the Rose of Compassion. It's a climbing tea rose, kind of common, but I always loved it. My mama used to grow these in America. Do you miss America? This is my home. Came to Asia quite a while back and fell in love with this place and just don't think I'll be leaving here.
A bank with your money was robbed. They got away with about 200,000 US dollars. Most of it was yours. Can I ask you a question? Aren't you the motherfucker that told me that that's the safest place to put my money? Yes, sir. You said it would be safe. You know, I took your advice. So, if I were you, I would get my money back. It shouldn't be difficult. It was marked. Well, I don't want to hear any stories about how easy it's going to be. I want to hear that we got it back. I want results or I'll take these fucking rose clippers and bury them in somebody's motherfucking eye. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. If there's a next time, you can't come in shooting the place up like that, man. No need. It's too much. You thinking about doing it again? Thinking about it? I'm up for another run across the border. Yeah? We were good, right? Fuck yeah. <laughs> Guess all those video games finally paid off. I'm all about the money, baby. Big time. Especially after taking so much shit for so long. It's nice to have some real cash. I'm gonna buy myself a new set of wheels. Whoa, don't do anything crazy, Sam. We gotta let that money cool off for a little while. A man's gotta have some fun, you know. I'm just saying, don't be stupid. Be careful who you call it stupid. Just looking out for both of us, man. All right, go have some fun. Just don't go crazy, all right? I got lunch. I got a split. See you, pal. See you later. Sam told me about this place. It's not too bad, right? Oh my gosh, this place is amazing. You deserve nothing less, babe. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Baby, some of the cash we're gonna have to start putting into your bank account, all right? No more than a few thousand dollars at a time, okay? Well, honey, what about you? I want you to have some of this money, too. Don't worry about me. I took a little off the top for expenses. Now, if you want to take me out to dinner a few times or go on vacation, I won't stop you. Jack? We're not in any danger because of this, are we? No, babe. Avalon. You're safe with me, okay? I swear to God, I'll do anything I have to to make sure you're taken care of. I promise. I know that Jack only wanted the best for me, but there are always consequences for our actions. Hello, Jack. One of my two Farangs. Who the fuck are you? My name is uh, Niran Watana. I'm your new best friend. 
That's okay, pal. I don't like the friends I have. I don't need another one. Really. That's funny. If that's the way I see it, I could use one right about now. What are you, a cop? There you go, calling me names. <laughs> Hold on to that. That was a lot of money you took from the bank in Cambodia. Especially for such a small town. No? And all of that U.S. currency. I don't know what you're talking about. And the butter. Is it helping? Yeah, actually, it does help a little bit. I am getting really mad now with this bullshit. The money? Asshole. I found in the closet. How'd you find me? It's all marked. And you were so eager to exchange it that it showed up on my radar real quick. Now. This is how it's gonna work. I'm gonna give you the names of the banks in Cambodia that you are gonna rob. You're gonna do exactly as I tell you. Come again? The banks will be guaranteed to have just as much, if not more, than what you took from the first heist. For my service, I get 50% of everything. And unfortunately for you, today, you and your partner have already split the money. And while you were out, I took my 50%. That kind of wipes you out. <laughs> I'm not doing this. Of course. I knew you were going to say that. So here's the other option. No. You played a dangerous game, and the rules have changed. No, wait. Okay, wait. 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 Okay. Wait. wait. No, no. You know what? I think I'll just talk to your boyfriend, and maybe he will recognize the generosity of my terms. What? Okay. I'm sorry. You want to say something? I'll do it. I'll do it. See, Jack. Best friends. I have a little something for you. Keep it close. I'll be calling. But just in case, your girlfriend? Well, I'm sure that she's gonna be somebody that I will be meeting quite intimately if you fuck with me. Take care, buddy. Hey, baby. Can you untie me? Hang on. Hold on. Hold still. Oh, my God, Jack. What happened? Looks like I stole from some bad guys, babe. Uh. Are you okay? Evelyn, they took all your money, doll. Oh. They took all the money. But it's okay. I've got it worked out, all right? We got a deal, and I'm going to get your money back, and I'm no, going to no, get you no, more no, money, no, okay? No, 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 no. Listen to me. Look, okay? It's only money, Jack. I'm worried about you. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Oh, God. I'm okay. Yes, but you... It's going to happen. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry, baby. I'm so fucking sorry. So you're pissed? 
I think it was crazy and stupid. But I also think it was kind of romantic that you robbed a bank just for me. I'm glad you feel that way, baby. Because I'm going to do it again. You sure about that, Jack? I don't have a real job. If I don't do what this guy says, I'm going to be in deep... Money is not important. Now, let's straighten out the bedroom so that I can take care of you. Yeah. You ready? Yeah, we're ready. Listen carefully. There's a bank in the town of Sisopon. Next Wednesday. Exactly two o'clock. Not before, not a minute later. Do you understand? Yeah, 2 p.m., Highway 6. On your way back to the border, there's an old petrol depot just off of Jungle Highway. You'll see a black BMW. Go there immediately after the job. Jack, I know exactly how much money's in the bank, so don't try and be wise with me. Don't worry about it. Yo, I gotta talk to Greedy Greg. Tell him it's Jack.
Shut up, Heavy. This is a courier without a goddamn box. Thanks for seeing me like this, Greedy. Sorry I haven't been around making no say that you. shit, man. What you want? Uh, well, this may seem kind of strange, but <clears throat> over the last few years, making runs for you, I've noticed that, well, the packages, sometimes, sometimes inside of them, there's, um... Yo, nigga, get to the point, man. You see I'm doing some shit, right? Ain't no time for this bullshit. I want to pick something up. Pick something up like what? I want to buy some heat. Heat? Guns, man. I know what motherfucking heat is. What I don't know is who sent your 1989 talking ass here for guns. The package is greedy. I gotta open them sometimes. Look, man, you know I've never taken anything off the top on a job. And I'm only here tonight because some of your bags, they got, they got gun parts in them, man. Rifle rounds, large magazines, machine gun shit. Now, I've been doing some new work lately. Some work that requires more than a pistol, and I don't know where to get that kind of shit this side of the world. Thought maybe you could help. Look, man, maybe this is a bad idea. I can just leave. No, 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 you ain't just leaving. You ain't going nowhere. You understand me? What you're going to do is you're going to lift that shirt. I'm serious, man. I ain't playing with you. I ain't wearing a wire, Greedy. I just got nowhere else to go. All right, all right. All right, I'm not one to turn away business, you understand? Let's see what, what paper you got. American. Well, now we talking. So what kind of heat you looking for this evening? AR-15, Brad AM-9, AK, submachine gun, shotguns, anything heavy. All right. Let's take him upstairs, fellas. Come on. Bam. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this'll do. Maybe this? Definitely that. Okay. Good choice. You know, I like you, Jack. I hope you're not getting in over your head. Then the guard went for his gun, and I looked at him real mean. He knew if he touched this pistol, I'd take him out just like that. Nobody moved after that until we were leaving, and I shot the fucking sh All right, Jack, what happened to you? You got a voice that carries, you know that, pal? I was telling Tracy or Sharon or whatever her fucking name is about some TV show, that's all, mate. Can I talk to my friend? Well, why'd you do that for? I was about to tap her fucking ass. Let me talk to you outside. What's up, Jack? What the hell's wrong with you? Talking about our business in a fucking bar, you stupid? Don't call me stupid. I let you get away with it once. Don't fucking test me, okay? That was Cambodia. The police can't touch us here. We don't know that, Sam. Maybe they can. Maybe somebody wants their money back. Do you ever think about that? What are you trying to say? I'm just saying, use your head. I'm serious, man, because we're doing it again. Okay. Everybody down. Get down. Everybody down! This is a robbery! Nobody fucking move! On the floor now! God damn it, Sam! Fuck! You, get up, man, it's a go! You open the sink! Open the sink! Open it! Go, 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 go! Keep your mouth 
shot! Keep down, motherfuckers! Out, 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 out! <laughs> Shit. Trigger happy back there, don't you think, Sam? That's the way it goes down. No room, no time for nothing else. I only shot him in the fucking leg. That was a cell phone. And what if it wasn't? Who reaches inside their jacket doing a robbery? You told me to cover your ass, Jack. And as normal, I'm covering your ass and mine at the same time. Sam, cover us. Don't shoot a motherfucker just because he moves. Do you want to kill somebody? Is that your gig? Because that's not mine. All right, we rob banks. That's it. All right. Follow me. We gotta make a stop. doing here, Jack? God damn it, Sam. Not another word till we get back to Bangkok. All right, you're getting paid. Stay put. Who's that in that car? Your boyfriend, he know about us? He knows what he needs to know. Nice feeling, right? Taking what you want, being in control. I don't feel much in control right now, Niren. No? All that money? And Avalon? How is she? Is she at that, uh, silly Muay Thai aerobics class of hers? I swear to God, you stay the fuck away from her. It must feel good to have enough money to take care of this young, hot, beautiful, and sexy girl. You, like... you slow, Aaron boy. Now you ease off that. There we go. We're buddies, right? Okay. You guys were lucky last time crossing the border. And now that I have an interest in you not being caught, I'm going to show you the old tunnel that we used to run shipping through. Come on. Follow me.
A guard was killed. Was that necessary? What are you getting soft, Niren? What's the matter to you? You're not a killer, Jack. You tell your party there to watch his trigger finger or he's gonna lose it. Understood? Who are you giving up, Niren? For these jobs? Moving up in the world, huh? <laughs> that I am. And that's all you need to know. No, I need to know when we're gonna be square. Square? <sighs> square has nothing to do with it, Jack. You'll know what I'm through with you. Later, buddy. And it's like this fish. People saying, well, I shouldn't eat the fish because the fish is, you know, an important sentient being, and that's true. Excuse me, sir. I have some news. Is it important? Please, sir. So what's the surprise you've been telling me about? What do you think? This is yours? Fucking hey, it is. God damn it, Sam, you were taking this back, man. No way. You don't even have a job. How are you gonna explain this? You're spending all your money on Avalon. No offense, Avalon. That is not the same thing, man. Fucking sure it is. I can spend my money on what I like. Now piss off! Kind of rough on him, Jack. Just stay out of it, Avalon. Fuck you, Jack. Take me home now. Baby, I'm sorry. Now! Just... Jack and Sam fought sometimes like a married couple. The stress was affecting us all in different ways. Or maybe it was guilt. Clearly, we were taking shortcuts to try and make our dreams come true. But everything was getting too real. Fairy tales started to crack apart. You ready? Whatever. Catch off! Catch off! Everybody down! This is a robbery! You down! You're making a big mistake. This is the Siren Carey brothers' money. You, big guy, get down, down on the ground. Last chance. You're both dead men. Hey, said get down. All right, manager, you, Sal, keys, keys. Let's go, let's go. Move, Jay. You and your men still near point bed. Yeah. Yeah, the Furans are making a move right now. Go do what I would do.
Sam, we have got to get to the bikes, man. Somebody just came into my bank and took that fucking money. They took the money because someone told them it was there. Waiting for them. These two photos are dead men. We can find them and we can kill them. But what's more important is to find out who the fucking rat is the inside because I think we know this is an inside job don't we looking at the banks I'd say these guys are coming from Thailand they cross the border they do the job and they go back well I'll get the money back but at this point I'm not as concerned about the money as my feelings I would really hate to kill you, you know. It would break my heart to kill you. If you think I turned on you, you do what you got to. I have nothing to be scared of. Unfortunately. I'm gonna have to wait to do what I do. Just a little bit longer. So I wanna be sure. I don't kill anybody innocent. What are the million dollars? If any one of my brothers who finds me this rat. I want his head to put in this fucking tray by tomorrow. I don't know what happened. These jobs are supposed to always be easy pickings. Well, maybe your secret connection ain't that connected after all. What do you think that crazy bastard meant? This is Heron Kerry's brother's money. These guys are bad news, man. They're drug lords. I heard about them on the news. It's probably their guys who shot the shit out of us. Yeah, and that crazy monkey running son of a bitch. This guy you're meeting after every job. Bro, you need to tell me who he is. I really don't know, Sam. He might be from a rival gang. He might be an inside guy. I, I just don't know. Look, this shit's running deep. And I need to know who's out to kill my ass. What do you suggest, man? I'm lost here. Let me have a think about it. 
Hey, Sam. It's good shooting. Cheers. Yeah, Niren. What do you got for me? Another bank score. Biggest one yet. Next week, a bank in Siem Reap. That's good news, because it's the last one. I'll tell you when it's the last score. Hey, fuck face. The commute? It's not working for me anymore. All right, and if you don't like it, maybe I'll tell the Sir and Kiri brothers that you're the one that's been feeding me these jobs. That gets you attention, asshole? And how are you gonna do that, Jack? You just do the walls into their compound, introduce yourself, what? I'm the American that's been checking your banks? You have no fucking idea who these men are. That may be the case, but you really should listen to this. Yeah, Niren, what do you got for me? Another bank score, biggest one yet. Next week, the bank in the real. Think they'll recognize that voice, Niren? How long you think you're gonna be alive after they hear that? Okay, cowboy. We'll play it your way. One last score. You give me my cut, you make some money. Then we'll go happily ever after into the sunset. And then we'll be... What did you say? Square. Square? Yeah, fuck you, Square. I'm not gonna spend the rest of my life looking over my shoulder, Niren. And I am not ever gonna let you hurt Avalon. Until next time. Sam, there's something I want to talk to you about, man. After tomorrow's job, Avalon and I are going to skip town. Where are you going to go? Don't know yet. Don't know? Well, don't trust me. Don't know. What are we doing? Do me a favor. Get me another drink. I'll be back in 10 minutes. That Yabba shit's going to kill you one day, man. You've got your vices, I've got mine. Oh, yeah? What's mine? Avalon Snatch. <laughs> Fuck out of here, man. Hey, man, sweaty cop. Uh, cigarettes? Do you sell cigarette? cigarettes? OK, cool. Whiskey bow. Whiskey. Uh, and water. Plow. No plow. Right, I want to get wasted, you know? Okay, cool. Thanks, man. Fuck out of the car, motherfucker! Chance down. Fuck, man, don't worry about that, man. Okay, we're gonna get you some help. We're gonna get you the fuck out of here, okay? You're right. You said this shit would kill me. Sam. No, 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 Sam, don't, 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 no, don't, man. Sam, don't fucking do this, man. Fuck. Sam. 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 Fuck. Fuck. God. 
Yeah. Yeah, I bet you're real torn up. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got it. Fuck, that was fast. What? That was my connection. You already heard about Sam. Says I still gotta go through with this next job or all bets are off. Well, what does that mean? It's not good. Well, you can't pull it off alone, right? No. Nah. No way. I gotta find a new partner. Somebody I can trust. Well, you're looking at her. <laughs> Honey, I wasn't saying that for you. Who better to watch your back, huh? Sam was your first choice, I get it. He was your best friend. But now that he got himself killed... No, Avalon, there's no fucking way. Come on. I'm perfect. I've listened to every detail of your other jobs. I know what to do. Yeah, I know you're perfect, but there's a big fucking difference between hearing about a bank robbery and actually robbing a bank. Yeah? So how did you start? That's not important. Why, Jack? Why won't you let me do this with you? I, I don't have to tell you why. Yes, you do. No, because I don't want you to get hurt. Now, that's it. End of story. Check this. I can handle this gun with my eyes closed, Jack. And when I was growing up, my father taught me how to shoot the snot off any predator on Earth. That may be so, but it's different. And with a body like this, <laughs> you better believe I know how to protect myself. What if you got to shoot somebody? Because on this job, we might have to. You ready for that, Avalon? You ready to kill somebody without hesitation, looking them right in the eye? Because that's going to happen. I'll do what it takes to protect you out there. Just like how you've been protecting me since the first day we met. I don't want to kill anyone, Jack. But if it means you'd be safe, I'd do it. This is crazy. You're crazy. So? Okay. okay. Let's go through it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Here we go. Didn't think I'd find a car this fast, did you? You got all the moves, baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now let's go over it again. Okay, but I know what to do. a little practice for the fight tonight. You got any big money on a fight? That's right. You know it takes big money to make big money. Well, you got that kind of money. I could afford that. How you could afford that? 
You insinuate Knight something to do with that shit? I'm just asking you a question to see what you have to say. I can't stand up to you. You want to think that of me? I'm loyal till death. You've got no right to accuse me of anything. We heard about the bang. You just let those two felons get away with our money. Hey, they almost split my fucking head open. I spent the night in hospital. He's all right, man. Look, ever since you guys took over, I played by your rules. Giving you your share of the gambling. I got nothing to hide. Let him go. Big money on the fight tonight, huh? Good luck with that. Hey, what are you doing? What? It's not like I'm ever gonna get a chance to do this again, okay? You gotta look good. Hey, do you remember? We wear these. They're like protection. You it covers our face. Fine. Well, just in case, I wanna look good for my mugshot. You're ridiculous. I must be a dumb motherfucker or something because I keep putting my money in these banks. And the only reason why I did that because one of my most trusted employees told me that was the safe place to put my motherfucking money. You know, I'm, I'm having trouble believing this shit. Two Falun's got away with $500,000 US currency. You're done. You think I'm stupid? No, Mr. Sirkiri, uh, you're the mastermind, and I wouldn't have gotten this far without your leadership, sir. To add insult to injury, they're telling me that one of the Farangs is a girl. I don't know whether to fucking kill him or hire him. And what do you think, Niran? I don't think anything of it. I'm not amused, not at all. I want these two Farangs dead, and I don't want them dead today. Can you take the wheel, baby? 
Yeah, okay. Okay, you got it? Yep. Oh. oh my god, Jack! You've been shot! Okay, I got it. We have to go to a hospital. Are you fucking crazy? Jack! Look at us! Do you want to spend the rest of our lives in a Cambodian prison? Okay. Okay, fine. The next time we get to, we're going to a pharmacy and we're gonna get some supplies to patch you up, okay? Okay, that we can do. Fuck. Answer it. Hello? Avalon. Is this you, my love? Who is this? Where's Jack? I said, who the fuck is this? It's Niran. You know? His connection? Now let me fucking talk to him! Who's Niran? Give me the phone. Yeah. Avalon. She's quite spicy. What do you want? I want my share of the money, you cocksucker. What do you think? Nah, in an hour, meet me over at... can't do. Maybe in a little while later, maybe tomorrow. If you try to run across the border with my money, I swear to God, there'd be nothing better for me to do than to hunt you down and kill you. And that loudmouth bitch. Hey, calm down, motherfucker. I got shot. I'm not going anywhere. I gotta patch up. Don't you die before paying me, Jack. Well, you know what will happen to that sweetheart of yours. You know what? It's enough of the threat, man. You got some settling up to do. Just stay close to your fucking phone. Fuck it, Jack! Honey, I got everything. Did you get the sling? Mm -hmm. Good girl. No, sir. No one's seen any sign of them. I'll wait here at the border until it closes at midnight. Call you if anything happens. Okay. You're gonna have to go take care of this. Be careful. Geisha, he's at the border. Contact all of our hotel connections. Let me know when you got something. You ready? Yeah. It's like we talked about, all right? Put some of that vodka on the key. Yeah? Okay, now pour some right on that wound. <laughs> Okay, okay. You ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Have all come on, do it. You can do it. You can do it. Okay. Do it again. Come on. Okay. One, two. <laughs> Baby, you gotta do it. You gotta do it, Avalon. Just stick it in there and pull that bullet out. Okay, okay. One more time, come on, you can do it. Okay. You can do it. Yeah? Okay. Okay. One, ready? Two. Two. Three. I'm sorry, I can't do it, I can't do it. It's okay. It's okay. Baby, you have to see a doctor. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. We'll find a vet in Thailand. And somebody we can buy off. Well, it has to be soon. You've lost so much blood. <laughs> it's not that much blood. Hey, hey. Hey, we're gonna be okay. I'm gonna be okay, all right? You're gonna bandage me up. And I'm gonna be just fine. Okay, all right? Okay, okay. 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 <laughs>
fucking amateur. My brother was right. A rat's got no balls. As new as you, you fucking snake. Look at me, Niran. I want you to see this coming. But you didn't see that coming. Babe, wake up. Jack? Jack, wake up. Jack? Jack? Are you okay? I feel like shit. Oh, babe, we gotta go. You drive, okay? I'll load the guns. Why do you need to load the gun? Oh. We're going home, right? Yeah. We'll go home. Uh, I just gotta take care of my connection first. Hey. Baby, it's okay. I promise. Oh. Jack? There's an old temple off the highway, 10 kilometers west of Siem Reap. Be there at one o'clock. Not one minute before, not one minute after. Do you understand? I'll be there. on your end. Don't let him out of your sight. Tell me exactly where he goes. And don't fuck it up. Yes, sir. What now? We wait.
Officer Inquiry. Where's he headed? Siem Reap Temple. I'll take it from here. Old Temple outside Siem Reap. Hey, Jack, you look like shit. I want my money. Give me that duffel bag, or I'll shoot that little bitch. you, baby. He'll never hurt us. Jack, we need to switch cars. Turn around. Just keep driving, baby. Bitch, all she's got, okay? Keep your eyes on the road and don't look back. Got it. Faster, baby. Just keep driving. Maybe slow down a little bit. Put some distance between us, though. I think the border's a few miles up. 
We'll figure it out there. Okay, baby. We're gonna ditch the car. We can grab a boat up the river here. <coughs> Who were those guys, Jack? It's a long story, babe. I thought you weren't hitting banks. Me too. Turns out these gangsters launder their money through the banks. <laughs> hey, it's okay. Looks like we're home free now, huh? Okay, the plan is, you're gonna get out of here, and I'm gonna hold him off as long as I can. No! Baby! No! Look, Avalon, I've had a life, okay? And I spent the best parts of it with you. Jack! Baby, back at the safe, there's almost a million dollars, okay? You're gonna Jack, it was never about the money. Can we just give it back to them? <laughs> it's past that, babe. Okay? You gotta, you gotta get on a boat, and you're gonna take that money, and you're gonna get out of here. You're gonna disappear and get out of the house on an island, like we talked about. No, Jack, please don't do this. Okay, you're gonna buy don't, a house. Please don't do this. Please don't do this to me, please. Jack. Baby, I love you. And this life and the next, okay? Okay? I love you too. I love you. And you gotta go. Baby, you gotta go right now. You gotta go right now. Go, 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 go. <laughs> favor? Yeah, I'm so grateful for that. Please don't hurt her. You don't come into people's yards, steal their money, and shoot at them. Because people like me might get lucky and kill you first. Just don't hurt her, man.
I don't know why Gan Sirankiri spared my life that day. I guess even monsters have a soft spot. Maybe I reminded him of someone in his life. Compassion still lived in him somewhere. I'm grateful I lived the fairy tale with Jack, if only for a short time. But the price was too high, and I would give all the money in the world to see Jack again. Now Jack lives on, but only in my heart. <laughs>